are tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Well, Black and White Sports fans, if you actually thought that the Paris Olympics were the most woke Olympics we've ever seen, and up to this point, I agree it actually was, it was more woke than the social justice Olympics in Tokyo. I mean, the Paris Olympics guys took it to a whole new level. But guess where the 2028 Olympics are going to be? In the People's Republic of California. In L.A., man. Los Angeles. Los Angeles, I should actually say. L-O-S-T. Because that is another communist utopia that the left has run into the ground. It's a disaster, guys. A complete disaster. But however... The 2028 games is actually going to be there. And that actually leads us to talking about one Megan Rapino. Now, Megan Rapino, um, of course, she retired. We all know how that ended for her with the USWNT uh, tour ACL, not an ACL, but uh, her Achilles. And that was the end of her career. That is the way she went out. Now, Megan Rapino has been a big bit supporter of one Colin Wokenick, you know, the social justice warrior that actually says he's banned from the NFL, even though this man has been given opportunity after opportunity after opportunity to actually try and get back on with the team. But he didn't want to, man. The NFL bent over backwards for this man, bent over backwards for him. And every single year now, guys, around this time of the year, he comes out with a new griff talking about, oh, I'm working out. We just need a team to call me, that kind of thing. But Colin Kaepernick, man, you blew it. You blew it. Even a lefty like Stephen A. Smith knows that Kaepernick doesn't want to play. Now, in the 2028 Olympics, guys, there's actually going to be flat football in the Olympics. Now, flat football as an Olympic sport, man, uh, doesn't really do much for me. But apparently Colin Kaepernick actually wants to um, play on a flag football team. But here's, here's the thing, guys. Colin Kaepernick, by the time that Olympics actually um, comes up in 2028, the guy's going to be almost 41 years old. Yeah, 41. Now, flag football, man, could he do it? I don't know. Is he actually going to do it as a quarterback? I don't know. But I believe that patriotism should be at the forefront of anybody representing the USA in the Olympics. And Colin Kaepernick clearly hates the United States of America. No bones about it, man. Remember, he was actually kneeling for the national anthem. Well, Megan Rapino has made an insane gesture as to who should actually be carrying the flag for Team USA At the L.A. Olympics, guys, let's get into it. Make sure you guys like this video, subscribe to the channel, become a channel member, member live stream every single Friday at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. You guys can also support us by becoming a member on blackandwhitenetwork.com or supporting us on Locals, both for just five dollars per month. Check the links in the description. So here we go, guys. Check this out. Megan Rapino remains delusional, wants Colin Kaepernick to be the Team USA flag bearer for 2028 Olympics. Now, folks, we know that one LaChina James was actually the uh, flag bearer for Team USA at the um, Paris Olympics. He got a whole bunch of backlash, guys. Remember, this guy was actually kneeling for the national anthem in that 2020 bubble. And I told you guys before, I believe that uh, Colin Kaepernick is actually more anti-American than LeBron James. Megan Rapino also. But Megan Rapino to actually suggest Colin Kaepernick should actually be carrying the flag is insane. Is insane. First of all, I don't believe that Kaepernick is actually going to be on Team USA. I don't see that happening. But she has been shilling for Kaepernick for the longest time. 
So let's go down here. It says here doing a recent um, podcast episode with Sue Bird, who essentially has the same brain and shares the same opinion as Rapino. The former USWNT player gushed over finally getting to meet Kaepernick in person at the Paris Olympics earlier this month. I didn't know they actually met each other. I didn't know. But anyway, quote, to actually be able to talk about the things he went through, talk about the things I went through, stuff with our families and our mind being radicalized in certain ways through our actions was really, really amazing. Rapino said. Bragging about your mother being radicalized by you taking a knee on a field is wild behavior, but it checks out in this scenario. Rapino and Bird explained that Kaepernick told them he was interested in playing for the Team USA flag football team in 2028, which led them into another bit brain conversation about the former NFL quarterback. Quote, he would be so good at flag football. I mean, he would be so good in the NFL. Rapino said while uh, staring into the camera. He's not good at football anymore. The man is washed up. You see how delusional man Megan Rapino is? But she goes on, quote, uh, let's just be clear about that. He's still being blackballed by the NFL right, right now. No, he's not. Folks, the man has been given like four or five opportunities to actually get a shot to come back in the NFL. The man doesn't want to play. He can't play anymore. But she goes on, quote, I would love to see Colin be able to represent America in an Olympics. I think that would be a special. He's my flag bearer. I think that would be really incredible to have that representation of America be front and center. Rapino continued. So she wants pure communism on display at the 2028 Olympics. Folks, if Colin Kaepernick were, at, were to actually hold the U.S. flag, that man may actually burst into flames. I mean, that is just how radical he is. Because, guys, he is extremely radical. The man hates the police. He hates the USA. When was the last time Colin Kaepernick actually stood up with his hand over his heart when he actually saw the U.S. flag or the national anthem was going on? I don't think Kaepernick wants any part of that, to tell you the truth. This scumbag right here, man, should never, ever, ever represent the USA, man. Because Colin Kaepernick truly doesn't want to be American. I mean, this man grew up in the greatest nation on this um, planet. Given an opportunity to make millions and millions of dollars. And he's actually profited off of grifting once his skills eroded. He made money off of not... Not standing up for the national anthem. He cashed in. He cashed in, guys. We all know that, man. Megan Rapino is out of her mind. Colin Kaepernick should never, ever, ever touch a U.S. flag, man. This man hates his country. And he should not be representing our country whatsoever. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, and we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.